Hello, hello everybody and welcome back to a, another episode of my MapleStory NA Reboot Adventure. I hope you guys are all doing well today and enjoyed the last episode. Now, some sad things happen. I already recorded this intro and some gameplay. As you can see on level 136, not much happened. I've got the same gear, all that kind of stuff. Unfortunately though, what did happen is I decided to, I did a, uh, basically I did a, is it a Frito portal? The yellow portals, the hunter ones. I got two advanced pouches, um, opened them. I got an epic potential scroll and a silver potential stamp, I believe. So, actually no, I might have got this potential stamp from my monster exploration. Anyway, either way, we use the epic potential scroll on our, our secondary weapon and it worked. And I got, and I had three master, uh, master, not, yeah, three master craftsman's cubes also from, um, just throughout the thing from the, the, you know, random stuff you get it from, it's pretty easy to get them from. Anyway, um, I decided to use them on my secondary and it went to unique. So now I have a unique nine attack percent emblem with two lines. I need to try and get three lines on it. The silver potential stamp I had failed and a 6% attack emblem. Really good. <laughs> like this character is very lucky so far. Every potential stamp so far has passed. Not only that, I've also had a tier up with one Master Craftman's Cube from Epic to Unique. So uh, feeling pretty lucky right now, to be honest with you. Feeling pretty lucky. I don't really know if there's a better secondary weapon than this um frozen one either to be honest with you i don't know if the normal one's any better i don't really think it is so uh yeah this might be the forever one i'm not too sure but anyway it's very good whoa baby you are loud anyway we are level 136 and uh, we have just been training uh just over here basically uh we've been training at the moon bunnies um which is level 120 to 128 unfortunately we are past that now but it's time to go to yellow king goblins and basically just train here um in this episode we are aiming to get to uh level 160 i think is going to be the goal we're going to do some bossing and um, we're going to unlock some new bosses do some pre-quests for them um and probably just yeah see where it goes from there really we do have a, oh i just noticed it's 100 percent knockback resistance on this class that is unbelievable that is so nice 22 percent boss damage i think basically all of that is coming from um my uh what's it called you know those things <laughs> what is it again my uh link skills there you go but when i get my um this uh Rudy best set i will definitely be getting a bit more boss damage which is very very nice anyway i'm gonna get to level 150 probably here um something along those lines anyway and i will come back when that is done Okay, guys, you catch me here at level 145, and I have to be brutally honest with you. I recorded the beginning of this episode um, a week ago. I am currently halfway through my university placement. It is five or six days after I recorded the last clip. Um, I, like I said, I'm not, I'm not really being able to play. I have to go again next week, uh, so I really only have an hour or two today to try and play and record a little bit. But what I wanted to do was something a little bit fun, and that is Wonderberry. I think that's what it's called. Let's have a look. I believe Wonderberry is back in the in the uh, the NX shop. <laughs> Wisp Wondrous Wonderberry. Now these can give you perma pets, which is something I'm very interested in. So as you can see, I've already charged myself up to fifty eight thousand NX credit, uh, and we are actually probably going to go up to bronze uh, bronze four here, which is pretty cool, I suppose. But anyway, we're going to buy Wonderberry. Um, we're going to buy. Probably 36,000 worth. How much does that leave me with? 40,000 leaves me with 18,000 NX. We'll do that. And we'll play with the NX credit, baby. Boom. <laughs> oh, yes, 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 yes. And now I've left myself with 18,000 because these things look pretty cool. I just can't decide if I want it or not. Okay, this is annoying me now. All this keeps popping up and ruining it. Okay. Now, do I want to buy this stuff? So what do you get? You get a hat? A cape? See, I don't like that the sort of crossbow. Hmm. 
It does look kind of cool though. I might buy it, I might buy it. In the meantime, we're gonna get all these out and we're gonna hope for a lovely little perma pet. Cause a perma pet would go a hell of a long way. Now I have had time to read over the comments on the um, NA versus EU reboot video. Um, and there is more people wanting the NA. However, there is people also who are wanting the EU or at least me to finish the EU to then go into NA. So um, like I kind of said in the last episode, um personally i think i'm gonna do more na um just because it's a bit of a you know it's a new adventure there's a lot more i feel like that can be done or you know there's more people to meet uh, i think it would be better for you guys there's a lot more of you on this server um so that is one of the the main reasons i also just remembered i don't have my uh sound on i'm so so very stupid <laughs> let's turn that up quickly um yeah so you know there's so many more of you um over on this server so i just feel like it was probably the best idea um but yeah i think apart from that um I've actually that's it's a bit too loud for my liking i'm gonna turn it down there um but yeah and i'm still gonna upload na reboot um or a year reboot i should say um it'll be a bit more spread out but i will do that but that works anyway because of the fact that it is kind of gonna take a little bit longer um to sort of record those episodes anyway uh because you know i'm not at that stage where i'm progressing super quickly anymore but anyway <sighs> wonderberry let's do it panda i don't believe is a uh, perma pet so boo to that one more time doge also not a perma pet i don't think that's a perma what is that no so they do dry up in like months time though interesting another little husky oops no oh that could be promising i don't actually know what it is or not no 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 penguins definitely not please i'm spending so much money please monkey i don't think that's gonna work balrog Oh, doge yikes i don't think any of them are helpful they're not damn that's so much nx gone is disappeared that's fine um i mean we you know we have pets so i guess we do have a berry puff and a mango puff um i suppose that's that's interesting <laughs> oh man the unlucky streak is continuing if we want to we could maybe buy some more um with when i'm streaming um after next week because obviously like i said i'm on placement then after next week i'll probably get streaming um and we'll maybe open some more of those if the event is still going on which i think it will be anyway um i'm gonna continue on like i said i would in this episode anyway can i buy pet oh, i can't buy pet food from you unbelievable um very nice okay let's pop the pet food up here Make sure we can feed our petty boys. And let's roll around with our berry puff. Yeah. Sounds pretty good to me. Let's go, berry puff. <laughs> um, okay, yeah. Like I said at the beginning, I'm going to keep continue to level, I should say. Um, all the way up to probably um, level... Maha! <laughs> um, level around 150, 160, something along those lines. Uh, I should also say that there was a uh, passive skill, or an active skill, sorry, I got, I completely forgot about, which was the adrenaline burst. It basically activates adrenaline rush instantly, um, and it, it does have a 240 second cooldown. So, uh, I guess, a pretty cool skill. I'm going to continue to level, like I said, and uh, yeah, we'll be back when I'm level one, probably 150. And just like that, we are level 151. I did do some bosses. I did a, <clears throat> oh my God, excuse me. Normal Zakum and uh, Easy Horntail. Um, so let's quickly just sell those. We might as well get rid of all of these pencil ear gears as well. Because pencil ear gear, normally very helpful. But for me, very not helpful. Because the frozen gear is just so much more superior. The only things I'm looking to keep really are um, going to be gloves because well gloves and shoes i should say because those are the two things that uh you do not get in the frozen set oh very nice so that's actually better than the ones i have none of them are better however okay cool let's quickly swap out those gloves 
Oh, yeah, I forgot to say I also have these. <laughs> oh, God, I'm a bit stupid. Oh, okay, we are, like, frozen. There we go. Wait, now it says plus 33. What? What is going on here? Anyway, we have these to equip and stuff as well. I got very lucky with all the drops, actually, when it came to um, doing the bosses, so... We're very happy about that. Oh my god, dude, the lag is so bad. Quickly sell these intense power crystals. Uh, don't need that, don't need that. We're gonna keep all of the gems and stuff because I believe that actually could be helpful in the future for if I want to do like the Meister ring, for example. Okay, so level 150. With level 150 comes a bit of a nice gift and that is my Rudibus set. So... I'm going to get all these um, along with a weapon box. Going to open this up, get my Moonclave. Now, <laughs> my damage is about to get a little bit nicer. Uh, let's quickly see all these. And we might as well do all these while we're here as well, right? Okay. Okay, 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 okay. <laughs> oh my god so that that has some pretty bad flames actually i'll probably definitely reframe flame that weapon um that is also a pretty terrible flame that is a pretty terrible flame but it's okay that's not the best flame either okay so there's some reflaming needs done on all of these that is actually oh no that's 57 decks i thought it said 57 strength okay i'm gonna quickly star force up my these two and the silver blossom ring and then we will equip all this and we will see where our damage range is at after that and we are back from doing all that so we go from around let's quickly buff up have a look Sixty-nine thousand range to Oh. 140,000. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> that is just insanity. Wow. Okay. I mean, so these are usable until 924. So what is that? I mean, 9, it's only the month of 6. So around more or less around uh 3 months those are useful for which is very handy to be honest i think we should be able to do cra within those three months 100 percent um yeah okay very very cool very cool um i don't know specifically what else i'm gonna do now i don't know my plan also we do want to keep all these for obvious reasons um we want to make sure that we keep them because when our stuff does you know uh, disappear if we do not have um our own cra by then we do want to probably keep those uh for that frozen set damage and stuff anyway so very nice indeed anyway um next on the list i would say is probably i don't know if i want to level to level 160 or if i want to crack on with doing some pre-quests or um we have 172 coins available let's quickly get that oh i'm not actually on the synergy grid yet that's that's good assign units um this bad boy what is he it's like an l shape um can i do like a little twisty situation oh i can okay like that no what am i doing wait i can't do that really first thing i got Ah, okay. That, oh, there we go. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, wait, why am I in luck? Oh, what am I doing? I need to be in strength. There we go. <laughs> that makes a bit more sense. Okay, let's quickly jump in here. Get the Legion coins, which we definitely should be able to do. I accidentally clicked on my second monitor. Monitor. There we go. Okay 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 we're a bit better off up to 118k range now just from that little bit of a uh, boost from the legion board let's quickly go get some epic potential scrolls from the legion people here because we would love to chuck an epic potential scroll up onto our uh ring here and probably our face accessories to be honest with you how much things do we have we have 505 i mean we might be able to let's just take it one at a time 
and see what we can get here. First one, passed. Very nice. Uh, we do have some occult cubes. We can try and get some 6% strength on that. <laughs> oh, the luck is real right now. Okay, very nice. Let's do it again and go for our, um, I guess, our eye accessory. Ooh, fail. Okay. We only have one more attempt then. Fail. <laughs> it's fine. We got one epic potential though, which is pretty nice indeed. We also are up at the 88% boss now because of the boss damage on the weapon here. An extra 30% plus the four set, a set. So that's another 30. So that's 30, 66% uh, I'm actually getting, including the flame. Not too shabby at all. I would like to get a better flame actually on or better uh, thingy, I should say, on the Fafnir weapon. Um, ignore enemy defense actually is probably something I want. So we'll equip that for now. Let's see where we're at. 126k range boosted up. Not too shabby. Uh, boss wise, let's see what we need to do. So Zaku, we've done. We do need to do Magnus um, prequests, uh, easy and normal. Unfortunately, same goes for Hilla. I could probably do a normal Hilla now, actually. We do need to do the prequest for uh, CRA, which is easy enough. We should definitely be able to do that. And I will need to complete the 10 days of killing them anyway. So we should probably get on that AS ASAP, really. I have also done the um, PAP prequest and I have defeated PAP once. Um, and that was, it took a while, but it was a pretty easy fight, to be honest with you. Von Leon, uh, there's no need really for me to get Von Leon armor or weapons, so I don't know how interested I am in doing Von Leon. I mean, I might as well do it for the pro boss crystal, I suppose, but I'll do that at a later date, I think. Horntail, we're all good. Arcarium, I need to do the pre-quest, which are a pain. It's the uh, full sort of um, Silent Crusade thing. It's 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 not too fun. Cygnus-wise, okay, easy Cygnus, I can do whatever I want. And Pink Beans, 160. Okay, interesting. Um, should check on. Okay, very interesting. Um, I think then, I guess my next step for bosses should probably do the CRA and Magnus prequests are probably my my first two steps. Um, I don't really have time to do them today, so there's not much point. I think what I'm going to do is just continue to level up, and um, that's probably going to be my best bet. Uh, probably get to around one level 160 or you know, we'll see wherever we can get to I guess um, And then I will come back when all of that is done. I think I'm just gonna be leveling up in uh, Kerning Tyra for now probably somewhere here Seems pretty good to me. Let's see if we can. Oh, hey there. Mr. Elite boss. How you doing today? I did not know this guy was here <laughs> Okay, well, we'll take that right I also forgot I do need to go ahead and take a uh... Now these guys are very good to attack actually Oh wait this wait did I not actually pick it up what the I thought the, my pet picked them up what in the hell Oh no what did I just get anything good no, okay, nothing. But it's fine. We did get one of these boxes as well, right? Rare treasure chest. We get a gold potential stamp. Wow, actually really good. We're definitely going to chuck that on. Woo! My God. That was a lot of lag. We're going to chuck that on our secondary weapon here because it is unique. It only has two lines. Oh, yes, 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 yes. That is what we like to see. Um, okay, I will... Um, yeah go ahead and level up a bit i think is there something else i wanted to do no i don't think so not off the top of my mind anyway there probably is i'm just being a bit stupid but that's just that's just normal me to be honest with you okay i'm gonna level up and i will be back okay dogie it is the next day for me and i am level 160 which is very good to see very happy with that and um, not much happened when i'm training really all that happened was i did a polo apollo portal 
a Frito portal, I can't remember which one, Frito, I think, um, and I got two advanced hunter pouches, um, I used them, I just got two Medal of Honors, so I'm up to 137,000 honor XP, we are going to re-roll this in this episode, and hopefully get up to unique or legendary ability, that would be very nice indeed, um, apart from that, not much, uh, the arcane symbol selectors, I got them just because it's a Sunday, uh, the Sunday specially type thing, so, that's all that is um and apart from that not much else to report i am here because i am doing the commercy republic uh, quest line because the commercy is something you kind of want to get on instantly also i'm going to do the root abyss while i'm here um because the root abyss will be very important um it is you know oh god well we're just gonna do this first anyway um yeah rutabis is a very important thing that you want to get done um preferably sort of well i mean preferably as soon as possible to be honest with you you want to get these because you need to get 10 attempts of clearing cra so that's 10 days minimum before you can even attempt to do cra i mean in 10 days time i will be ready to do cra but i want to have that option to do it now as you can see the first episode of this na reboot solo progression is going to go live uh, in about two hours for me, uh, before I leave for my second week of placement, I managed to squeeze out an episode in the weekend. Um, so I hope you guys do appreciate that. Um, and it is going to be a solo progression, I've decided. I am wanting to basically do this um, progression series um, completely solo. Like I said, I want to be able to do it all without any help. Um, or at least any any carries or anything along those lines i want to be able to do it all the way up to solo these bosses um because that was the plan for my original aeu series um, which um i will still obviously be doing but i'm i that ended up not happening it just turned into a progression series this is going to be a solo progression so you know the gains are going to be important <laughs> um right let's see if this works it does work oh i just clicked x damn it good damn it how do i get out of this place can't even jump like that okay that's fine <laughs> um this is literally you can just follow what i'm doing for the pre-quest if you want guys it is very easy it's not much to really do and just like that we are more or less to be honest with you uh this bit can be bugged sometimes it doesn't come up saying do you want to skip the, the cut scene or anything um at least this is bugged when i normally do it i have to uh normally log in and log out so i'm just gonna go ahead and do that and then i'll be back okay i logged in logged out again and it worked completely fine the, the scuts the cutscene thing kind of jumped up at me which is exactly what you want i don't know why that's still bugged i don't know if i'm doing something wrong i don't think i am i think it is literally just a bug this bit sometimes can be quite buggy as well um and sometimes i have to log in and out but i think we should be good so boom 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 News World Tree. Okay. All Seal Gardens to the Multi. Yeah. Okay. So I think that's more or less it, to be honest with you. Uh, you can probably use the boss thing to actually get back to CRA if you were wanting. Um, if you don't know in the Neo update now, they have it. So you can basically um, go to any boss instantly. You don't need uh, any sort of um, like help, I suppose. Um, so like you don't need to do well I mean you need to do the pre-quest but like you can teleport to a boss you don't have to go into a waiting queue uh, so that's very helpful if you guys need to learn how to travel to the bosses anyway um, I'm gonna go ahead and do all of these um, dark world tree guardian things I'm just gonna defeat all these bosses quickly which shouldn't take too long hopefully um, and then I'll be back in fact I might do a wee sort of spa uh, speed up of um, all these sort of little bossing montage show also this person looks awesome anyway i'll be back
And just like that, all the Rudibus bosses have been defeated. I hope you like that little sort of time lapse situation. I may have forgot to record halfway through Pierre, but it's fine. You guys saw the end of the fight sort of situation. It didn't take too long anyway. Now, next step, Rudibus is done. We are on to uh, Commercy, I think is going to be my next goal. Uh, Commercy, and then I'll look into having to do Magnus and Pink Bean. Um, and then after that, I don't think there's too much. Pink Bean and Magnus are probably the biggest pains. <laughs> um, but it should be fine. I believe I do have the... I've already done the thing for uh, Lomian and da Damien. Lotus and Damien, I should say. Yeah, so that's just level requirements 190. But I'm pretty sure that I should be able to uh, do those. I think I've done the... Because uh, they're sort of account bound and I think I've done them, so hopefully anyway i'm really hoping i have uh yeah i'm gonna carry on with commercy and then oh we also got this maha's domain um which is a new sort of uh sort of big thing i haven't actually used it yet um i guess we could go and figure it out can't we uh let's go have a look let's use it and see how good it is i'll get buffed up quickly maha! okay show me it jesus that's loud so does it oh it does continual damage yeah nice holy it's like a full map clear look at that <laughs> okay pretty cool pretty cool i'm also kind of annoyed because i forgot that you had to actually activate the travel journal so i killed probably like five thousand mobs yesterday and ended up not actually getting any of them which is a bit of a shame that pet looks cool Anyway, uh, yeah, I'm going to crack on and I will be back when I have done the Commercy prequest. And just like that, I have finished my Commercy runs for the day. We are up to 55 dinero already, which is very nice. As you can see, these are all the um, intense power crystals from normal CRA. So we are going to sell them for a nice little amount of money, probably around, you know, I can't remember how much, 10, 10-ish mil, 10 to 12 mil, something like that. Not too bad it does tell you as well i've got 54 more this week so you got 54 power crystals plus that four to sell so they bought he buys 58 power crystals a week or along those lines um as you know i sold some normal zakum ones as well i think he buys about 60 um which is a good amount i mean that's a good amount of power crystals you can get a lot of money from that now Next goal, uh, we've done Commercy, we've done CRA in this episode, which is very nice indeed. Um, honestly, I think what I'm going to do is roll my inner ability, because I'm not going to lie. Oh god, it's just very laggy. Um, I want to get a unique ability. That would be unbelievable. Um, honestly, boss damage, meso, or buff duration. A, a good high, like a high percentage of those things would be probably ideal for me um meso wise um, i'm probably just going to meso farm on this character oh that was a 20 percent buff duration actually it wasn't bad but it's only an epic ability we would like to go to at least unique and then i'll lock that probably in unique for now well to be honest with you i might just keep rolling i'll just cut away and i'll keep rolling until i just hit legendary so if we look, we're at 135,000 right now. Let's see where we're at when we come back with hopefully a legendary ability. Oh my God. <laughs> it did not take long at all if we just got to legendary. <laughs> so we're locking that, which puts it up to 10,000, but it needs to be locked. We just need to reroll these now. So this is going to disappear very quickly. All passive skills plus one level excluded things. So is that just to put this up? Yeah, so these are all just one now. Not really worth it, to be honest with you. Nothing there. Magic attack plus 30. That is useless. <laughs> Critical rate plus 26%. What? Holy Jesus. That is insane. 26% crit rate? I mean, we'll lock that, I guess, right? I've never seen that before. Last one. 5% assigned to strength added to dex. What in the world? <laughs> that is stupid. <laughs> I mean, holy hell. That crit rate, though. That is a, this insane. Okay. Very interesting. Um, not too bad. I can't believe we got 
26% crit rate. I, th I just have a feeling that's that's a very good one. I don't know if it is or not, but I just have a feeling it is. Um, okay. Wow, we pretty good. <laughs> I can't believe how quick we got that legendary ability. To be honest with you, that was that was insane. Um, but we we will take it. I suppose we will take it. I also have a question. Is the um, inventory stuff a, a count bound or like? Because I swear this is more than you usually get. Maybe it's not, but I have a feel. I thought you only got up to like here. I seem to have more on these ones. But I don't know. Maybe not. Honestly, I think to finish off this episode, we are going to go ahead and do a bit of cubing. I think we're going to go ahead, buy some cubes and try and level up this to legendary and maybe this to unique and see if we can get even more attack because that would just be unbelievable. So I'm going to go ahead and buy some cubes and let's get going on this to end the episode. Let's see what we got. We got 12 black cubes and six red cubes. We are going to just get judged right into it. We're looking for a tier up, which would be... See, right now, I'm not going to lie, that's actually better. Just because of the sort of attack we have, I believe that is better. Now, if this actually... Oh, ignore enemy defense. Oh, da, 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 da. We'll just keep going, because we will get legendary. Because we're just, we're just that lucky, you know? We will get legendary. <clears throat> tear up. Ooh, boss damage. And tear up. Nope. And tear up. Oh, no. And tear up. Oh, no, it's not doing it. Oh, I don't even know anymore. Oh, whoops. I didn't actually mean to take that, but it's fine. <laughs> just tear up for me. Oh, that's better. Okay. Tear up? No. Okay. No tear up. That's, that's sad. We had no tear up. Okay. Now. What do I do? <laughs> do I... Uh, do you know what? No, it's fine. What we're going to do is we're going to red cube. We're going to red cube our emblem. And aim for a tear up. Because I think that would be, that'd be very helpful. Please. Please. Oh, that's actually quite good. But it's fine. Please. Tear up. Now. Oh, didn't tear up. Okay. Well... We made zero gains. <laughs> but that's the way it works sometimes. You know, if that did end up tearing up to a, a legendary or a unique, we would have made more gains. So that is just the way it works. you got to spend the money in order to get the gains. Um, so in this episode, we got to level 160. We did the Commercy prequests. I got some Daenerys. We did the CRA uh, which prequests and did some CRA runs. We did some cubing. Um, I'd say that is a pretty successful episode too. And we got to legendary ability as well. We've done quite a lot um, for this sort of episode here, which I'm very happy with. Um, if you guys did enjoy, please do leave a like and subscribe. Um, we are aiming for 500 subscribers. We will hopefully be there actually by the time. But uh, any support is just amazing. Follow me on Twitch as well over at twitch.tv forward slash maple or it will be linked down below. Uh, and yeah, I hope to see you guys in the next episode. Peace out.